Hello, today I'm here with a new first impression and today it's time for my other palette from Certify and this is the Dynasty palette. I did not plan to buy this, I only wanted the Tropical... only wanted... I was like, I'm going to only buy one palette, it's the Tropical Wonders, I can leave my first impression up here. But it was 40% off during Black Friday, I think, so I bought them both. So the Dynasty palette is pretty similar to the Tropical Wonders, but it's maybe not as many different colors and also this row is shimmery. So I'm going to do my first impression and <laughs> when I did my Tropical Wonders I did two different eyes and I want to do that today as well. As you can see, um, it's like a two-part palette. So like this is the more warm part and this is the colder part. So I want to do one warm eye with some of these colors and then the other eye with some of these colors. And I think I know what I want to do. I'm pretty sure. And this is the same exact same size Tropical Wonders. I think all their palettes are like this. I like the artwork of it and I like that it's cardboard but I don't know if I like to open a palette like this because it's very long but at the same time you can bend back the lid so it's very easy but it's a little bit different to have the palette in this form instead of like this but okay <laughs> I'm going to hop into this first impression stop talking and start to do my makeup so I'm going to zoom you in and I think you maybe liked it more. I am not sure. Um, <laughs> but I'm going to zoom you in so you can really see what I am doing. So okay, I think I want to start with the warm eye. So I will, I will start with Queen in my crease. So I'm going to take this in my crease and... Oh yeah. So the shimmers in this palette is going to be the first shimmers I try from Certify. And if you didn't know, Certify has come to Beauty Bay. I feel for me it's not so big of a difference because it's a UK based brand and no taxes or stuff like that for me to get it here but <sighs> Beauty Bay is really fast with their shipping and also with free shipping but at the same time I want to support like um, a small business in the brand but it's so fun that they are on Beauty Bay okay so something like this and this shadow was so nice and I think I would do one eye at a time. I also want to deepen down my crease because I always do that right now. And I take Riches, this one, on a smaller pointier blending brush. I am so concentrated. So I want to do like the same look. But with different colors on both eyes you will get what I mean. And then I will take cloak, 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 cloak. I will take this shade and put it on my lid. And I think I will, I will take it on my whole lid. Oh. oh, hello, pretty shade. These shades seem pretty alike now when I have them on my eye. But I think I am okay with that. And this shade was amazing. And I want to save my inner corner for something else. Okay, that was <laughs> so freaking fast. And it blended perfectly. Easy, quick. 
super easy easy quick super easy really good words okay I think I will take velvet this one and put it on my outer corner and you must be sick of me that I do like the same thing over and over again but I am like that I find like a way that I like to do my makeup and then I do my makeup like that for a pretty long while yeah I think that that uh, blah, blah, blah. yeah I think that that is good oh my lord oh my lord I do never say that in real life and I will do the inner corner yeah I can do it now for the inner corner I will take no <laughs> okay I think I will take this one and that was gem this one and I will pop this in my inner corner and now I will try my first shimmer shadows from certify first impression like because this is the first impression it's good but it's no it's nothing like amazing about it nothing like out of this world but it is not a bad shimmer I think it feels a little bit dry if you like compare it maybe to um, use space Okay, and then we will go over <laughs> to the next eye. And here, I am not sure which color I want to do. I was like, I'm going to do a green eye. But now, when I think about it, I maybe want to do a blue and a purple eye. Okay, I think I will do a purple and a blue eye. So I will start with grand. Put this in my crease. Now we'll see. As you... I want to like blue shadows and I think that I am in a good way but when I start to use blue shadows I realize that they are hard to formulate um, and the most of them are they are dry and yeah, it seems just like a hard color to do and I was like damn it <laughs> maybe I should have learned this before I start to love a new color just to realize that it's not good but I think this is I think this is pretty good it is not as vibrant as this but it's maybe pretty true true to pan um, it's not patchy, it's easy to work out, it's easy to blend, so nothing like that. So nothing <laughs> to complain about them. And now I look a little bit uh, crazy. And then I will take Emperor, this blue one, and put it in my... To deepen it down here. And I hope that this works. So now we'll go in with the purple and I have to see which shade was the lighter shade. Okay, so these are the purples. And I will take Empress and put it on my lid. Like my whole lid into here. I really hope that these two will blend together like the Emperor and the Empress and I think they should be good together because it's Emperor and the Empress or maybe they want to fight each other then I want to go in with um, this elite and 
just deepen it down a little in the outer corner. I don't know if this is going to show, show up because um, where the emperor and empress met it is already a little bit darker. So maybe this was totally unnecessary. And okay, for the inner corner of this eye, I have three choices. So one of these, either purple. I think I will go with the green one, so I just, so I get the green into this look, or maybe the silvery blue. No, I will take the green one. And that is glisten, 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 glisten. And this felt a little bit more creamy than gem. Maybe not. I think that these will... These... The, I think that this these shadows would be great to spray. But they work like this, but I, I feel that they can be so much more intense if you spray them. Um, but I'm not going to. I was so confident, like, I'm not going to spray this, but I think I will spray it. Spray it. Spray it. And, <laughs> yeah. This needed to be sprayed. And I think I will take the pink one. I will take the pink one I have in here. Which was it? Was it? It was Yam, I think I took this one. And I will spray this as well. Okay, so these shimmers are better sprayed. Now we have sorted that out. The only thing, I feel like this green was so hard to work with after I sprayed it, it like it's almost like I had used a glitter glue or something or cut it because it does not want to move a freaking bit but I think I think I can live with this I have shit tons of fallouts as you may can see and uh, we can't uh, do our makeup will look like this so I will take away the fallouts I fix my base and brows and we will do the under eyes and I think I will do the same in my first impression with the tropical wonders I did the opposite but I think I want to do the same and drag this shimmer like down here as well so I will take out this fallout fix my base brows and then I will be back and we'll fix the rest of the eyes so I'm back and we are going to fix my under eyes and I will start with the size I will take this one the, the one that I have on my lid the most of my lid and take it underneath my eyes and this I really want to tap off then on um, this I I think I will take I will take Empress this one okay, this hair okay so I think I look strange um I will take these was it this one I took? I think so. That one and this one on my inner corners and I will spray. I'm so sorry if you can't see what I'm doing but this is really hard to show this on camera. Okay, so something like that and I will put on a mascara some lipstick i think i will go pretty neutral so it suits both eyes but at the same time i want to take something it's not neutral i'm going to focus here i'm so sorry if i'm not going to focus 
Um, and I will also take some pens in my waterwall line. I think I will take two from Linda Holberg, a purple one and uh, a red one. And something on my lips and mascara. And then I will be back with the finished look and tell you a little bit about my first, first impression. So hard to speak. Talk. So hard to speak. So hard to talk. I will be back. So this is the finished look and yes I have a black lip some lipstick. I think I will go pretty neutral. Oops. Um, this is the finished look and my first impression first impression with the Dynast Bell from Certified. So I have used like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I have used 10 shades. Did I really count it? Yeah. So I used five shades up here, so I used these fours and this one, and down here I used these fours and this one. So what do I think? I think the mattes are amazing, just like in Tropical Wonders. The blue and the purple worked good, and I love this shade. The shimmers were, if I like... If I think about how good the mattes are, and then if I think... Then if I think, if I think about how, how, oh, brain fart. If I think like, these mattes are wonderful, they are creamy, they are easy to blend, they works perfectly. And then when I think, what I, I don't even know what I'm trying to say. Okay, if I compare the matte to the shimmers. I thought that the shimmers were going to be amazing as well. They are good, I'm not saying that, but they are not as good as the matte. They are not good, as good shimmers as the mattes are good mattes. I think it is a good palette. The shimmers worked amazing when I spray them. And I am okay. And I like how the palette looks. I think it looks good. I think it's it's a good layout of the palette. And I like that all the shimmers are in the same here. In the same line. One thing I don't like about this, I don't think I mentioned it in my other first impression with Certify. The shadows have a lot of kick up. I don't mind at all. I I don't care. I don't think it's a bad shadow just because it has kick up. But the palette gets so freaking dirty. I don't know if you can see but like here. And I think my Tropical Wonders. I think this is a little bit dirty too. Yeah, I like the black. And that's the only thing I don't like because I usually don't clean my palette but I think I have to do this because the shadows like sticking on to the white. But it is a good palette. It will be fun to play with this more. I like it. So my first impression is good. So this is the finished look and my hair is so flat. I really need to cut my hair and I don't know what this is. Um... So I really hope you liked this video. I am not so used to having black lips, but I think I like it with this look. So I really hope you liked this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye!